going to make a string line. Gentlemen, I shall wait until my dashboard comes up on my phone before I type in the chat my formal greeting. Right now, we've got a download going on the Elder Scrolls Online. The uh, game developers said that they would be updating the performance recently. <coughs> Okay, good. Oh, I just clicked on a thing of cool stuff that they want you to look at. Okay, let's see how the game is doing. It looks like my computer has a lot of stuff going on. Let's cause War Gaming to exit so that it does not take up any more computer resources. So I need to take and do the Elder Scrolls Online launcher again. Troubleshooting. It happens a lot on this channel. I do not guild the experiences I have working with my devices because that's just not how I work. There we go. It just came up on the phone. Go to dashboard. Here is the story of lives in mountains. A young hatchling living on her own. She will show you all her mad adventures. And you will go with her as she grows. While we're waiting for my uh, game to load, I'm going to test the messaging system. Hello! Shout out to the person watching me. Hope you're having some fun on this fine evening. Right now, my a computer and my phone are disagreeing as to what time it is because daylight savings time happened and it always makes things a little bit weird. But have no fear, I can see whatever you type to me. Alright, we've still got loading screen on the thing. Now I've got loading screen back on my computer. And soon, you'll get some actual content other than a loading screen. I had some fun playing with Penelope and Cyril. Today, we are starting off at Bleak Rock Isle, which is where I ended up after our last session. Then after that, I think I'll go to Somerset after that, because I can. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'll do the quests on Bleak Rock, although I could probably just go straight over to Somerset. I kind of want to do the quests here, because I can. <laughs>
and then when she gets level 10, I'll be able to take her over to Cyrodiil. Cool. Spellcaster's Elixir. That won't do this character much good. But, hey. That's for next time, right? Okay. Iman and Mar- Mar- You know what I mean. Over here. It's over here! Out the main road! Out! Out, out! Get out! I am going to find a dude suffering from hypothermia and a woman who has three friends turned into uh, no. skeevers. No. Alright, go on, show me. She shows you where the staff is that you don't get affected by. And then you take it and suddenly she can talk again. Like this. Oh, thank kind. You have it. So you guys went dicking with the staff, the huh? When a mad <laughs> mage ran up and began throwing spells at us. I think he only nicked me. He dropped that wand in the snow as he left. But what does it do? I don't know how spells work. I tried picking up the wand, but it wouldn't let me. I think it does the spell. Or undoes it. Probably both. Look, my friends are Falka, Brend, and Runzenwald. They're skeevers now. Please find them and use the wand to fix them. Alright. Ooh! While I'm here- wait a minute, how much gold do I have? Not very much? Alright, then it's probably not a good idea to try and buy something from that auction runner house person type thing. <laughs> Why don't I just run through every possible noun except the correct one for the situation? <laughs> that sounds like a great idea. <laughs> well, anyway. Ooh, Columbine. That stuff's very useful and kind of hard to get. Sky Shard! Oh cool, skill point. Skill points! They sound kinda like kill points! Interesting that I only need the ultimate from this one, but it's really, really powerful ultimate. Like, seriously powerful. Oh, there's that skeever I need to unskeevify. Welcome back to being an Argonian, runs in wild. Now there is Rolanda. Come to prove your courage. So did my brother. Now he's gone. Actually, I'm here Thank to help you. you out. I just hope we are not too late. My brother never he kind of blundered I'm in into no, a cave you a man. with a he mage. How about ten years ago? Who? Well, you'll see. First, I'm gonna see this runestone placed in my crafting bag. Oh, it only had a mundane rune. Ironically, to all you crafters out there, ooh, I can morph, morph spiked on armor. Wow. Good, it's a good thing I can morph a skill. Too bad I can't speak properly. <laughs> cool. Now I'm getting this one skill. Frozen. Is it someone you know? Guess who I am, and I might let him go. Alright. 
Anyways, I was trying to say <clears throat> that for those who craft, we know that the Keep mundane walking, runes can be, be pretty uh, useful. Search for clues. Get a clue. You'll make a lovely squirrel. So inquisitive. All right. So it looks like the people who went into this cave died. How oh, rude! Digging through my things. What manners? Okay. Apparently, that's his skeleton. More skeletons. Doesn't look like there are any Nord skeletons in here. Oh, that's the frozen man. I'm not ready to talk to him yet. But I am ready to find this box or this journal. Leave that be. That's private. <laughs> they warned us it was cold. I can't believe people live here. I'm gonna get out of here and get back to the warmth of the woods. <gasps> oh, that was your plan, but it didn't go well the way you planned, now did it? A valid empty soul gem. I must have either forgotten to put them all on. Oh, I know what happened. I put them all on a character who has soul luck. So, that's why I don't have any empty soul gems. Look up, greedy squirrel. See something shiny? Don't break your neck. Somehow I doubt you would lament me breaking my neck, Frozen Man. Astounding! You've accomplished the impossible, leaping small rocks. What have you thought, clever squirrel? Do you have a guess? Well, yes, I do. Digging away. Puffy little cheeks. What have you found? The journal married a spy, spy. am I? But why? Oh my. And what else? You're a smart one. Exact. Whatever will I do with you? That's no fun. Join me inside. We'll play a game of shells. Win, and you get Iman. Lose, and you'll be my new squirrel. Okay, fine. Only since I can't complete the quest without actually doing this part. Here I am, or am I here? Guess wrong, and you're mine, my dear. Or not. No fair. He's always the one standing still. In case you were wondering how I solved it so quickly. Well, that and I've done it on like several other characters. <laughs> to me. I'm a shrub. Let Iman go. Your soul is missing. Want mine? It's black and gooey. One year game. Now let Iman no. go. We're having old friends for supper. Drink some roots. Stay with us. You'll be safe here. Safe from what? The stones. The shiny ones. They're pretty until you turn your back, and then whoosh. Skulls implode. Bones shatter. You're talking about a cave. This is my safest place. My friends are here. Don't take them. I don't want your friends, I just want Iman. Want, want, want. Greedy squirrels. We wanted to leave here, but then... Shiny stones. I ate them after. They were cold. They hurt my teeth. What about this room? Do you it want gives it me back? headaches, and it tastes like sawdust. Go on, you eat it. Iman will die if you don't release him. People don't die. They change shape, like Aroway. She's a candlestick. <coughs> She's bright as the stars. And Tarak? He's never been happier. If you don't let him go, I'm gonna have to hurt you. The shiny stones did that. The roots, the water, 
Oreo's three toes. I tried to save him, but his head wouldn't stop leaking. Now he's a milk jug. If Oreo's a candle and Oreo's a milk jug, that makes you a bear trap, doesn't it? So? Nobody wants to be caught in a bear trap, not even squirrels. That's... that's the first thing you've said that makes any sense. <laughs> Fine, take Iman. Just leave my friends alone. And don't blame me if the shiny stones get you. <laughs> Alright, dude. You have fun with your crazy lunch. <laughs> Welcome back to what not happened? being frozen, Iman. Did you see those Covenant soldiers? What Covenant soldiers? They were exploring the cave. They laughed at me, hanging in the ice. Frozen men got them. Let's get out of here, bro. Twice. Hey, Rolanda, I got you your brother back. Hopefully, he don't go blind or fucking into another trap. Because that would kind of suck. To have to dig him out of another trap. Oh, there's a pewter scene. They might have materials for cool stuff, like okra, for harvesting and making jeweled furniture. Did you find him? Yep, Thanks I gift. found him. I can't thank you enough. There were soldiers, soldiers from the Daggerfall here? Covenant, by the way. We're going, dumb ox. <laughs> we're going, you dumb ox. The cave is incredible. I mean, have you learned nothing? Seriously, man. Seriously. Ooh. I have learned that there are all kinds of wonderful natural resources on this little island. Going there again, and I leave you to rot. Oh, good. I can morph Searing Strike now. And Soul Trap, too. Ooh, bow increased to seven. Draconic power increased to seven. Paddle flow fishing can. This appears to be a nice little warm stopover for people who need to catch some fish. It's also a very convenient location from which to de skivify this person. Falfa. Butterfly. And there's some nightshade. Ooh, with a hunter camp and a metric fuck ton of spiders. I'm not sure if you've seen my channel before, but in case you haven't, I have taken to posting my videos of this gameplay on YouTube. So, if you feel like watching this without the uh, buffering that I saw when I first started watching the replays of my uh, gaming here, You may do so on my channel at YouTube. I'll have to tell you in the chat once I remember exactly um, what the uh, username is, how you would be able to find it. There we go! People from the Fighters Guild got themselves into a load of trouble. And I am likely to receive a spider egg. Let's pick up some metal while we're here. Nice that I did not get interrupted while attempting to loot 
It must have been because I had, uh, gotten almost to completion of gathering. I've noticed that it tends to stop you if you literally just started gathering. Let's have her sneak. Oops. I'll have her sneak while I take a look at my YouTube channel and show you what the username is. This will only take a moment, or at least it should only take a moment. Whether it will or not is a different story. I also learned that my recording should be exactly the same as my live stream. And YouTube. all of it. My name is Silver Sands 13. Capital S in the front of Silver and capital S in the front of Sands. There we go. Now you guys know what my username is on YouTube and can go check out my videos without the buffering. Hmm. I wonder if that cocoon is lootable. It would be in Skyrim. <laughs> no, it's not. It's just decorative. <laughs> Sometimes you get pewter out of mining the iron seams. I think that's cool. And it kind of makes sense. A lot of time you end up with metals being in approximately the same location. Thank you. I'm not sure exactly which metals go where, but that's what degrees in metallurgy are for. <laughs> I did hear at one point that iron and gold are closely um, approximated to each other. And I did hear also that a sky shard is up in this location. Wait a minute. Up in the mine. There we go. One dead frostbite spider. Ooh, and rawhide bracers. Now I've got some more, oops, armor. Yeah! Better armor rating, but the stats on them are meh. Okay. So I'll just go off and wait in the mountains and stop that spider from cannibalizing. They get so much harder to kill when you let them cannibalize. They heal themselves right back up. Oh, nice. I hit level six. How wonderful. And I got soul gems and experience. My lucky day. Now I can pick molten weapons. But what I really want to do is morph this into Venomous Claw. That way, I can start using my natural skills.
Ooh, they look like a tanky type dragon knight. I appreciate. Ooh, there's a chest in here. They haven't tried to go after the chest. So I'm going to see if I can unlock it. It'd be a big score for Weights and Mountains if I do. Yes! I did it! I unlocked the chest! Ooh, and got good armor to boot. Guards are leather. Ooh, me likey. Skill, oh yeah, Ledgerman shows up on your bar. There we go! Ooh, maple. I smell death. Bura not My too comrades bad. have returned. I erect the spine of gratitude. You are a hero today. Glad I could help. Your scales stay moist. By the way, we're not heading back to the village. We have our own boat, and we're getting off this cursed rock. <laughs> if you're ever in Davin's watch, you should consider joining the guild. I'd put in a good word for you. Thanks, bro. Well, that's one more set of villagers that I don't have to traipse around and try and find. Okay. To a dragon hold I go. It's technically an old dragon shrine. I don't know if you you get to play Bleak Rock. Actually, I do remember that you get to play uh, through Dragon Barrows and Skyrim, but I don't think any of them involved a. Uh, this uh, bleak rock isle. The least of our worries. Bandits are plundering the mine, looking for artifacts. Like what kind of artifacts? Looking for something. Had to kill the one behind me before he warned the others. All right, how can I help? Subterfuge. I'll stay here and keep an eye on these bandits. Take the uniform from our friend here. Then get down into the mine shacks and see what's going on. All right. My friend here. His kit will help you slip into the mine unnoticed. How I've long have you reported to Captain Rana? On the island. She really is a skilled commander. This just isn't her finest day. Or mine. Why is it called Hosen's Folly? Sure. It was named after a prospector who came out here with his family. They said they were mining for iron, but folks saw them wearing dark <coughs> robes. Hmm, that sounds kind of suspicious. One day there was a fire and the whole camp burned. Locals said they heard monsters roaring. The place has been boarded up ever since. Okay, that sounds like a very interesting story. Watch out for the Hey! I was uh, supposed to go put on the bandit disguise and go subterfuging some bandits, not. Oh, babbling at Captain Rana again. It looks like this gentleman here has lost his disguise. And I am going to deftly avoid this sentry. Ooh, that was close. If I get... <coughs> oh, cool. I actually got larvae out of the flesh flies. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Let's wait till this guy patrols back again. Jump out of the house. 
and manage not to be seen. That person's been drawn by someone else. Lucky for me, not so lucky for them. Ooh, you can push the E button to scroll through things. All right, these are just normal frost ledge guys. I'm going to wait for the sentry to patrol away from his own aggro, her own aggro range, so that I do not get popped. If I run, I will not get popped. Okay, so it looks like those cultists were in league with General Syrian of the Daggerfall Covenant Army. Contract. There's the flesh flies I was after. This is the funny part. Stands in guard. Get lost. The boss wants me to come check on the relics we come found. Inside. We've almost made it past the scabs. I heard them say the portal is just beyond. Okay. Oh, that's not going to help you. The guards are already either dead or too far away. And by the looks of the corpses on the ground, I'd say they're all dead. Even so, I don't really need this disguise anymore. So, if I find a sentry, I can just kill them. Like that sentry. But I would rather avoid combat if I can. So, there I go. Avoiding combat. Ooh. Wonder if the bookshelf is readable. I'm always in for a good story. Oh, look. I can kill some scamps. Here I go, searching some urns. Let's see if I can earn some gold. <laughs> and the answer is yes, I had to. Oh look, scam. You're an easy one to kill. And some bookshelves. Which may or may not contain useful skill points. Like that. Ooh, destroy the unspeakable sigil. You know, this kind of reminds me of Oblivion. goes the scamp. That is the statue of a Daedric Prince that I don't recognize. I'm kind of
kind of wondering why you would put traps in a so, mine, though. What did you, a covenant it's not as if you need to trap your mine. Oh, I hit level 7! Wonderful! Now, I'm looking at light armor, and there is a uh, medium armor. Stamina recovery. Let's look at my weapon skills. Technically, they want me to have... Volley for AoE, but I really don't want to use Volley. Okay, so they say Magma Armor is a good ultimate for me to have, so is Molten Weapons. Let's look at Draconic Power here. I'm four points away from buying Dragon Leap. Let's look at Ardent Flame. Combustion. Increases the damage of your burning and poison status. You know what? I think I'll buy Windwalker. Other skill points are not far away. some local bandits. Now, where exactly are these bandits? Oh, how convenient. They're way the hell over here. <laughs> it appears that I have a person hunting after me in combat. I am not surprised. Those uh, bandits are aggressive, so... don't have to stop by the town to get to where I need to go. Oh shit, Brand is way the hell down there. Oh yeah, I remember now. You get to unskeevify Brand at about the same time as you rescue a gentleman who lives at the uh, local mill and I thought that was a mountain flower yeah. and so he is on the way but is not in this location that's convenient for the quest I'm currently doing Ooh, less of this though I imagine I'm about to find a quest I remember at some point there's a quest with a bat. There we go. Two dead frost ledge. Some burnt up supplies. Oh, 
and the dude who was captured. That was easy to see. Try being a little less obvious with your movements next time and you might be a little less dead. <laughs> Cause my AI sucks. <laughs> Ooh, who is that? I've never seen you before. to take your food cuz I'm hungry I'm a hungry lady and I like me some venison with some millet and some ginseng I hear that's good for you keeps your stamina up and such like Mushrooms. I love mushrooms. And it looks like you are the quest man Something of the hour. Apparently, this is another haunted spot that young Nords like to play with because they're bored. I guess when a uh, mammoth tipping doesn't do it for you, you go to skeleton tipping. Oh wow, a legendary Kuta rune. the other. And Sky Shard! There we go. I've successfully hunted the Bleak Rock Sky Shards. My man! Me. Yes. You need to Somebody's desecrating your shrine, so I came by to fix that. Maybe all these skeletons will go back to bed once I do. Since I'm here, I may as well grab the whale rune stone. But first I'll grab a butterfly and some columbine.
Ooh, you're a lightning thing. Making hollow jack crap. Tremora boots and hollow jack daggers. Oh, there's a Denata. <laughs> One of my guildmates said his UI isn't responding. And the one of the other uh, guildmates says, "Have you tried yelling at it?" And that's hilarious. the side of a Haldrin. No there is. Eh, we'll see about that. You have fulfilled your purpose. Well done, well. Ooh, scroll of banishment. So he's an ex lifeguard. And there is no exit. There's no back exit. I'm used to there being a back exit. The undead are gone. What did you Found they necromantic here. evidence. He was romancing the necks of the dead. And all these skeletons are no longer aggressive to me. Alright. So... Let's just recall. 
Total Recall. I will not stop until every villager is found. <sighs> and apparently I will not stop yawning either. Resources. It is the dawn of a new age. Sven, are you okay? That's actually a cool name. Oh, good. I totally and utterly forgot that I can use all of these. Poisons. So many poisons. Delicious and wonderful poisons. <coughs> Banker. Take a load off. Yeah, I would say your bank is the most secure place in all of Tamriel. A tiny little town. In the middle of nowhere. Let's see if I can I buy a cool bag much. upgrade. It appears that I can buy a bag upgrade. Aha! Here's Halmira's house. Oh. And I just attempted to drink a potion that I have already drunk. Q. Protection. Yeah. Oh! It appears... My husband, Gil. No, that no. the guild is doing a skull farming run. This is great, as I enjoy skulls. Rexus! Please show me where your human is. Rexus is a proud human owner. He proudly takes good care of his human, humans. I shall make a mark of that chest and go obtain it, if it is still there by the time I find and save Brend and find and rescue Rexus's human. Rexus, thank you for waiting for me. There was one more person that needed saving along this trip of saving people. Wow, there are two chests along this road. It appears that not many people know about this place on the island. Here you go. Your dog found you. Let's do another working. <laughs> Dexterity is weapon critical. Hmm. 
Yeah, let's do that one. Let's go out to the statue of Iskramor. Because this place just looks cool. see here. Chest number one is over there. An intermediate chest. So I have some time to attempt to unlock this, particularly if no one is standing behind me, which last I checked, no one is. Ah, shout out to the person watching me right now. I've got another rawhide helmet. Most excellent. After that, there is a tree around this general area that had a chest in it. It still does. It appears that my chest hunting pays off. Another intermediate lock, and a chance for more leather gear. See, I am weights in mountains. I do not craft my gear. I find it either through questing or through other means, such as chest hunting and sigic portal hunting. That's why the first time chance I get off of this little tiny rock, I will head directly to Somerset and join up with the Sigic Order so that I may go hunting for Sigic portals and obtain fat loots from them. Because I've heard that the first gift you get from joining the Sigic Order is that they will give you the skill to see Can I portals. Interest you in anything? Yes, selling things, to be precise. Let's see here. Ah, yes, the Forgotten Adventurer's Shirt. So this adventure has been forgotten. Mala! They're alive. Here of your buddies back. Not furry anymore. Furry anymore. I don't know what Actually, their armor's pretty furry. Alright. So... I completed one quest underfoot. Do I have any other people? that I still need to find. Rinoff. First bandits, now the Covenant. I wish Dedring was here. All right, so Dedring is the one guy. Aha, there we go. Now I found the last thing I need to do. Make sure that's the right location. Yep, that's the right location. Must make sure everyone's accounted for. I have Almost everybody accounted for. Almost. And soon I will, in fact, have everybody. Everybody. <clears throat> Safely. Back at the camp. 
Now there, follow me. I've been hunting. Now I get to kick a massive bat's buttocks. Which is easier than you think, because bats often fly high. That wolf is barking at me. Take a butterfly. Gain two insect parts. And use a bone pile. And there's Deathclaw. for kicking Death Claw's butt. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Rawhide jacket with stamina. Now let's see if there's anything cool in his lair. Nope. Just some old discarded weapons. You will likely have an easy time taking this quest down, sir. Impstool. I need a sign on my back that says, We'll break for Impstool. That would be a funny bumper sticker. I'm going to have to head back to town soon, my friend. Lost a lot of blood. How goes the hunt? He is dead. Here's the coin I promised. I'll sing your praises next time I see the inside of a mead hole. Don't worry about me. I know the way back to town. Wound or no wound. Alrighty then. Now that everybody, and I do mean everybody, has been accounted for. I have almost made it to level 9. I am going to watch my rawhide jacket of stamina, realize that the one I have is better, and go sell crap. Then I will perform the evacuation quest. Oh, I already did that. I did more than you, Tilran, you snowborn, who were sitting there in the town square, yelling and crying and squalling about the fact that you want everybody accounted for, but not doing anything to ensure that, that actually happens. By the way, I find that disappointing. Let's see. All right, let's do that. I don't have any more sips of protection left. So the sip of health and a tincture of health. Make sure everyone's accounted for. No all right. Now I am all fully everyone situated. Stay calm. We've done all this before. Cool beans. I can tell Captain Rana that we're ready to GTFO and escape the Daggerfall Covenant. I'll prepare the town for evacuation. The people I've gathered everybody. The Covenant is here. I'm going to rally the village. Where will you lit. go? I don't expect to see those troops again. Cool. I'm going to maybe not steal from this dresser. Look totally normal walking around. And then see 
if I can steal from the upstairs. That's not valuable, so I'm not stealing it. Okay. That's not valuable to me, so I'm not stealing it. Which means that there's nothing for me to steal in here. Ooh, but there is a mushroom that I can take from this graveyard. The tree has a mushroom growing on it. That is how the gravestones of Nords look, by the way. Yeah. Off I go to wreck the day. I think it's cool how they use colored powder on the signal fires. That way, you know it's the signal fire and not just a random fluke. Actually, this signal fire is just normal colored. But that's okay. Sometimes you have, ooh, almost all of your health gone. Sometimes you have cool colored powder and sometimes you don't. Lots of bitter green. I'm just gonna take these greens. Wow. It looks like every last soldier that got garrisoned up there also got slaughtered by the Daggerfall Covenant's agents. I am threading the eye of the needle as I avoid the aggressions of the Daggerfall agents. Too many. Till Rani. There were just too many of them. I lit the, the signal fire. Here. What happened? They set fire to the village. Now Rald and I tried to protect the Earth Turner family and the rest of the farmers. Where Guns are they? To the bunkhouse. Ira tried to take shelter in my home. Then the soldiers set fire, laughing. Please, you have to get water. Save our people. I came to warn you, but the troops, they caught up to me. You take can't. it easy. Don't come back for me. Just get Ira, Denskar, Litrek, and Trinhild. I didn't see where they went. Rana's at the old tomb. Tell her, tell her, I forgive her. That's a good thing to do just before you die. You see that happening a lot. Characters that are really awesome don't survive. Oi, right. not cool to stab someone in the back. You are going to die for that. So rude. You have to do these farmhouses in order. Otherwise, it doesn't work. Hey. Denskar, run, make it. run like hell, go to the tomb, and run like hell. Oh 
look. I'd rather not steal from these guys, they're pretty cool. <laughs> if I was a sorcerer, that book would have given me a skill point. But I'm not, so it didn't. I think it's funny how people can think that a person who summons Daedra and conjures lightning and stuff like that is doing the same thing as a person who summons the dead out of the ground. Adventurer. Down go the Covenant. loot on him. How thoughtful. Nine gold just for me. Litric, hay is extremely flammable. You're gonna need to get out of here, like, stacked. Really? They even kill the freaking cattle? These guys are real nasty. I mean, I can understand going after the people, but the freaking cattle? Really? There's a murdered villager. Trinhild, you're not far from the tomb. And your family's going there too, by the way. And I have a covenant asshole on my tail who is going to run away because I leashed him. Welcome back. And we are going to do all the things. Ooh, and I'm gonna turn level nine. Let's go with the bow. I mean, it's not like I use bows or anything. Hmm. Let's do... Huh, that hits at rank 20. I don't need Dragon Knight Standard. I can almost use Draconic Power Ultimate. And I can almost use Earthen Heart. So I'm gonna buy Molten Weapons. Ooh. Now, I'm about to enter the place called Last Rest and disable the traps so the villagers and I can all GTFO together. Hit the switch. Dodge, bring them through. Dodge. 
charge is guarding the back gate. And you have a job for me to do. They need a leader. I need you to unlock a door. Actually, right now you're being a pretty good leader. You've managed to get most of them out safe and sound. Oh, nice! A necromancer showed up right behind me. Here, have a buff. Down goes the skeleton. Some gold and a bookshelf. I'm having a good day. Whoa, that does not look like pudding. Unfortunately, you cannot jump over those spike traps. Purposefully make the spikes too tall for you to jump over. Let's go that way. Did I forget to equip the Prophet's bow? Yes, by God, I did. And now, I have a new bow. All right. Let's unlock that door. This way. This way. And Captain Rana will tell me all about the trap I need to disable so that the villagers don't go running through a spike trap and get themselves killed. We're almost out. I'll unlock the door at the bottom of the stairs. Yep. Apparently, she has the unlock skill. There we go! Cooking mastery, the easy way. They've got the fighters up there on the platform. Hitting a skeleton. And there's that switch I need to trigger. I'll meet you on the other side of that door. All right. Okay, it appears that I got some woodworking skill. Captain Rana. Just beyond this door. I'll go on ahead. Wait for the rest of them here. Yep. stretching stretching looks like that's everybody all right now it's outside to talk to captain rana There's a nice little gangplank. Show that friend here. will get us to safety. He's a hero of the pact. And for what I've promised to pay him, he better be. I fear the cover <laughs> would intercept us if we went straight for Darwin's watch. So we're going to make for Dalmora, a small town down the coast. Are you ready to go? Yep, let's go!
Okay, it's time to talk to Captain Rana. We're here. We sprint. Go to the watch. Complete I'm that quest. Go to the watch We're far. It's the biggest. It's an Argonian. Argonian town. The first place I'm gonna go is to the Dalmoro. Oh, this is such a cute little town. There's a little guard. Actually, yeah, there is a guard hut over there. But there's a sky shard behind this building here, which I'm gonna collect. Excellent! Oh wow. Dragon's power. Huh. Yeah. Out I will go! And I will overshoot. Wait a minute, is this the right zone? No, but it is the right way to Fort Zarin. Ooh, a thieves trove. just yet. Plantation. Almost 6,000 DPS. Oh, cornflowers. Another sky shard. Go, go, go! Ooh, my arm is hurting. I'm crazy. Almost high enough level to go playing around in the Cyrodiil campaign. Let the cat fight those monsters! Wow! The island sprung a leak! Run! Dude! You sound kind of like a madman! Suddenly the ground opened. What in the world is go- You carrying?
for the animal that carries me. And thank you all for watching. That will be all for now. It is time to stop the stream. It is time.